Hey now, thanks for turning into another Race Grooves unboxing video. We're going to do a 2016 J case. If you see my H case, we got a cool piece. It was an error. You have the uh, Pro Stock uh, Pro Stock Camaro. It had a Super Treasure Hunt Tampo, Super Treasure Hunt color, but it had basic wheels. So I don't know what the I don't know what the regular car looks like. I might get a regular in there. Oh, that'd be even super if I got a super. But I also brought this here to show you that Mattel does not use I and O when they're using the case codes because it looks like the number one if it's an I. And of course, O looks like uh, a zero looks like the letter O. So they go right from H to J. On that note, let's get to it. This is the video that you want to watch. And post a suggestion or two. That would be one or two models that you might like to see for track time. When I do my track time for this case, I will pick some cars to race. Then I come back to the comments and look for people to get shout outs. Okay. Thank you for watching. Thank you for liking. And thank you for taking the time to comment. Uh-oh. Corvette Stingray. And black. Hey, this is a new model. You have the Honda Monkey Z50. Hey, that looks pretty cool. Pretty cool. I'm not a big motorcycle guy, but I do collect a couple colors of each casting. It's kind of small, uh, but that's probably what it is. Z50. Uh, would that be 50 cc's? I assume. That'd be a really small bike if it was. Oh, yeah, look at that guy. He's so much bigger than the bike. Is that a toy? Is that a toy bike, or is that a real motorcycle that people would... When I mean toy, is it something people goof around on, or is that something that you'd really see on the streets? Maybe not in L.A., maybe in uh, other countries where motorcycles are more popular to get around crowded uh, cities. Muscle tone. I think this is, a, yeah, an art car. What's the letter? T. So it looks like we are heading down the path to have HW art cars as the letters spelled out on the roof. Here we have the... Uh, Ford Shelby GT 350R, and that was in the last case as well. Nice to see it carrying over. TV series Batmobile is back, and it used to be called, I think, 1963. They keep changing the name on that. It looks like a flat back, flat black. I'll come back to that in a second. Here you have the Humvee in white. Let's see. It's kind of a flat black. I like it. Yeah, there's been a lot of Batmobiles. Hey, they missed the they missed the red tempo on the edge there a little bit. So, hey, it's got flames. Pretty cool. That's how they changed this one. Look how it has uh, flames. Ghost flames in the paint. Yeah, that's kind of neat. So this way uh, you buy another Batmobile. Hardy heart. I'm curious what it says on the base because it says, uh, they've been saying uh, changing the names. And on the base, uh, no name at all. So TV series. Batmobile, Fangster, it's 10 Camaro SS, another Humvee, Night Dragon, Terrain Storm, and a 17 Acura NSX. Nice to see this carrying over from that H case to the J case for those people who have not got a chance to get it. Hey, here's two cars uh, that we're going to talk about real quick. 66 Ford 427 Fairlane. So far, this is one of my favorite Flame Series cars out of the uh, 10 car set. This is one of my favorites so far. I just love the casting. But then again, so was the uh, Hudson Hornet was a beautiful release. Here you have the BMW 2002 in black. Very nice. USA stores, USA Walmart stores are getting a Walmart series, the BMW, not a Walmart series, they're getting a BMW series. Now, these have already appeared in the UK. Uh, BMW 2002 is uh, part of the series. So, uh, check out your Walmarts. If you're uh, in the UK, you guys probably already seen this for a month or so, right? So, nice to see it in the mix. No, nothing special on the back. Here we have a special one for the kids. We had Shark Cruiser before. I'm sure we still have Shark Cruiser. But Shark Bite. Look at that uh, wild design. And let's see. Check out the arrow on his lower jaw. Yeah, usually when they uh, put that arrow there, 
that means movement so uh let's check it out come here let's see hey check it out this mouth moves and if you see right here see the wheel you see the wheel it has this little uh black nub right here that's going to help his mouth go up and down when it spins around somewhere it hits something where's he oh right there look on his jaw right there see this part right here let me get closer spins around and it hits that lever so now his mouth will go up and down or maybe just open oh it goes this way because you're going to roll forward i guess if you go backwards it doesn't uh, it locks up well let's try it out real quick sorry it's in the distance but let's uh, let's try it out it locks up the wheel well i guess you just bite chomp chomp what if you go backwards it just stays open it's not like the old matchbox rollomatics to where you can keep going oh there it goes i guess i guess he had to i guess he had to get warmed up let's go ahead and move on now fun stuff for the kids and maybe some adult collectors will like that too 1985 honda crx two samples and a carried over from the last case as well as the ford shelby gt500 350r already showed that one in this case as well as a matter of fact here we have hw formerly solar new color muscle speeder this is a what was a clear speeder clear speeder was a project type oh project seed speeder had the open fenders now they closed the fenders and it called it muscle speeder so if you like uh, Hot Wheels history, that's a nice pairing to have. You can look for that other model. Here you have HW Rapid Responder. Oh, this one's pretty good. What, mine had a piece of metal right there. I don't even know if my other one's going to roll. So if I choose it for track time, i got to choose this one. Not the uh, other one, because it might not even roll. Chevy Camaro Concept. I love, I love this Hot Wheels uh, paint scheme that they've been doing to where it's uh, just part of the logo. And then the rest of the logo is just uh, pinstriping. I really like how they do that. You can see it on the hood, the wheels, and then they colorize it in the other portion. I really like that. <laughs> I like that, that very much. 15 Dodge Charger SRT. And guess what? Another art cart. Can you tell? Mm, you know, I hadn't been paying attention, actually. Have all the art cars had rainbow wheels like this? Uh, the Mini Cooper or the Mini. The Yeah, you know what? They might have all had colored wheels, and they hadn't even been connecting the dots so this one has c on it hw we already have hw a t i believe and c so very cool for those of you who want to make a collection of art cars with all the letters hey now the bmw series has eight cars in the mix but uh this one's not i'll do a video on these separately 73 bmw 3.0 csr CSL race car. I'm probably just going to call it the BMW race car. Too much. I have a hard enough time as it is. You can expect me to say all those letters. Very cool. What are these uh, two circles? Can't be speakers. They're speakers on the inside. You could look like speakers on the inside. I don't know what those are for. If you let me know, thank you. Look, uh, black. They have the interior coming out to give it part of the bumper. Interesting how they did that tooling. And then the interior comes forward. Oh no, that's a plastic window right there, because it looks like I can see uh, through it. So the window comes through the front lights, and it's the front, the side, the rear, those two circles. And you know what that piece, if it's not the window, it's the interior. But judging by the glare on the plastic, I'm guessing it's the window. I'm not sure. Hey, a pretty neat looking car. Castrol. Hey, we got a licensed tempo on there. That's what the regular one looks like. And I already showed the 17 Acura. So let's see what the difference is. So, wow, I can't even tell that much difference in the paint between the regular and the Super. Both have stripes on the top. I don't see any difference in the stripes. White interior. I'm looking at the tampos on the side. See, the regular does not have the TH logo right here. Whereas the Super... Or that's what it's supposed to look like and regular wheels see it has the regular wheels so this is kind of a cool error piece but there's a lot of them and I'm hearing a lot of people finding them but I don't know if people are finding them on the USA cards or just the worldwide I'm not sure and now I'm looking at the artwork to see if it looks like the super artwork 
Because look, even the Super didn't even have a TH right here. So it's a regular card, regular base, but it looks like they got a, a Super body. That kind of a cool conversation piece. 15 Dodge Charger SRT, another BMW 2002. And you have the HW Papa Wheelie. No tail decorations. And no printing on the front either. 12 Ford Fiesta. Another Camaro Concept. Another HW Papa Wheelie. Formulator. First one out of this case here. I'm not sure if it's been out before. HW Formula Solar again. That has four skinny wheels. Another Acura. Woo. Jeez. Can't find that. Uh, you're not looking hard enough. Got lots of them in the case and two cases in a row. It's got the front and rear skinny wheels for HW Solar. Solar. Hello. What do we have here? Come here. <laughs> another, another one of these. Another muscle tone. Uh, Dogzilla was in the last case. I think it was this color. It's the first one out of this case here. So, if you didn't get a chance to uh, pick it up, it's carrying over. Most likely. Oh, another other car. Three of them in one case. And, oh, this guy's pretty good. Hover Storm. Fantastic. Uh, he works very good on the track, actually. 65 Chevy Impala. Uh, black and white. And that's pretty wild. Tampos. We've got printing all over that. And last up, Aston Martin 1963 DB5 in black. Yep, we've got, uh, got some printing on the rear. Nothing around, nothing. It looks like we have a little hood emblem right there. You can barely see it right there, right? Anything in the front? Headlights. They try to do a little printing to give it the headlight appearance. And let's take a closer look at that Imp Impala. Now, what letters are we missing? Uh, well, there's the R. We're getting near the end of having all the art cars released. <laughs> wild, 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 uh, wild. I don't know if you, it's not tribal. It's not really pinstriping either. It's all over the place. Uh, what was I going to say? Oh, so this is uh, March 2016. So March, April, May, June, July, August. We only got like five more months. If this is the J case, we still have... J, K, L, M, N, skip O, P, Q. We only got six codes left for the year. So we'll have that last letter for art cars in no time. What's up? There you have the Great Gatsby and another Corvette Stingray. Mild to Wild series. Sixty-nine Dodge Charger five hundred. Another terrain storm. And there is the Aston Martin again, 1963 DB5. Hmm, interesting color. There's an, mm, yeah, that was already in the case. Charger 500. There is Double Demon. Hey, that's a new model. No, Mont <laughs> new model. I haven't seen Monster Racer in a while. Just a few months, I should say. So we got a uh, gold chrome version. Ooh, shiny. Very shiny. I'm sure, uh, I'm sure people are going to like to add that to their chrome collections. Super Volt in white. Keep calling that a fantasy car, but it's realistic. Uh, Chevy Volt, right? Olds 442 W30. Lifted. Just a little bit. And here we have the uh, Cloak and Dagger. I picked this up for Amanda's green collection. Uh, I got the one with the Target Spring card. And USA Target's getting a special card art. And it has a, it has like a, I don't have one handy. I'll show you one in a minute. Uh, but anyways, it has like clouds and stuff just for Target. It's kind of nice to get different card art. Cloak and dagger. I'll get a sample of that uh, cloud at the end of the video, okay? Rev Rod in silver chrome. Purple wheels. Check it out. Wow, that's pretty cool. Purple wheels. Looks good for him. Another hover storm. I'm two for two on the hover. Muscle speeder. You long time uh, viewers, you know what I'm talking about. I notice echo when I get down near the box. So there's the end of the box. I'm going to turn this sideways because it was giving me echo. 
uh, in the video, so I just turn it sideways. I'll minimize the echo. Epic fast. This this color is just really really nice. Like that release. Porsche 356A Outlaw in silver. That's the second colorway. I like that one as well. Aston Martin V8 Vantage. Hmm. I don't know. I think this is the first time. I don't remember if this was in H or not, but uh, I'm digging the Aston Martins in the lineup. And uh, I love this little Porsche too. I'm not sure. Uh, I'm not sure which one I would like more. Now I shouldn't. I shouldn't even started thinking about it because then I'm going to get stuck and slow down the video. Hmm. I'm not sure. I want to say the. Uh, no, I'm not. <laughs> There's another Epic Fast, another Night Dragon. And a GT Hunter with yellow wheels in front, white in back. Let's see, is that uh, an error? No, yellow in the front, white in the back. And you can check with other cars on the pegs. If they're all like this, that's how it's supposed to be released. It's not an error. That's how the designer wanted it to look. And here we have clear speeder in yellow and green. Kind of a Mardi Gras type colors a little bit there. And Chevy Silverado. And there's another 70 uh, race car, BMW. Wow. You know what? These these big uh, open hole five spokes, the color looks fantastic. It really spreads it out. Sometimes they get the splotchy color, and it's random, right? So it, and you're not going to get two that look exactly the same. There's your C again. Take another look. Next, we're down near the bottom. Mm, I don't know if it was a treasure hunter or not. Might not be. Haven't been so good with the basic. Not even the basic treasure hunts lately. Formulator. And there's Scorpedo and Stock Car. Three cars left. Uh, I'm going to get the, uh, I'm going to show you some Target Spring cars after this, okay, if you hang on. Porsche 356 Outlaw again, 12 Ford Fiesta. And there's the HW Formula Solar. Hang on, be right back. Okay, I won't be making any special video on these releases. So you see these, uh, these are called Spring Cards. That's what I heard. And it's got the uh, clouds. Very nice. Kind of neat to get store exclusive colors or special card art. And then if you put up a display, it kind of breaks up your collection. It has something a little special. And there you have the uh, X Racers uh, Cloak and Dragger. Yeah, Cloak and Dagger. Look on the back. Well, everything's the same. I don't know. UPC might be different, actually. But uh, let's see. Yeah, different UPC. Because uh, this way they know where it's supposed to go. And in the USA, it's Target. So here's just a couple of quick ones. They, regular cars. But there are two exclusive cars. I think uh, that's what I heard. This model here is only, only going to be in these spring cards. You have anthracite. And there's another one, fast forward or fast four wheel drive. That, this one and that Porsche fast four wheel drive is exclusive uh, for Target. That's what uh, I heard. Here's a couple more. Anyways, thank you for watching my JK's unboxing video. Happy collecting. Bye bye.